I'm your house cleaner, and you can verify my records. I'm Angela Brown, and this is Ask a House Cleaner. This is a show where you get to ask a house cleaning question, and I get to help you find an answer. Now, on this show a couple of weeks ago, I made a huge mistake, and I'm really sorry, and I'm here today to make it right. The information I gave you was a story about a woman who had this great big leather massage recliner that was damaged or ruined by a house cleaner. And then the homeowner called me and wanted to know, what do I do next? All right, the information I gave to her was you got to make sure that the people you hire in your home are insured and they can prove it. They are trained and certified and they can prove it and that they have workers comp and can prove it. Then my email started going crazy and I started getting IMs and I started getting Facebook messages and YouTube messages and podcast messages. People were like, whoa, how do I verify that information? You just do. <laughs> my bad. I'm really sorry. All right, so I went to task and I found a solution for all of us. In fact, it's such a great solution. I've invested heavily in it and I have become the spokesperson for verifymyrecords.com. Here's how it works. So you go to a customer's home and a customer says, this is the way it is right now before verify my records. Can you prove your insurance? And you say, oh yes, I don't have any insurance information with me, but I'll get it to you when I get back to my office. So you go back to your office and you forget. If you want to verify your insurance information with your customer, you can give them a policy number, but in order for them to verify that, they have to call your insurance company and the insurance company will say, we don't know Mrs. Peterson, we're not going to give her your private information. And so you have to call your insurance company and you have to say, uh, can Mrs. Peterson know that I'm insured? She's going to call you to verify that I'm insured. Weird and awkward if you have 30 or 40 or 50 or 100 customers, okay? And so in order for someone to verify that information, you have to have a talk first with your insurance company and you got to put every one of their names on a list. That's really high maintenance and that's probably not going to happen. Okay, so what we did is this. Verifymyrecords.com is a holding hub that holds your private information and it shares with the public the information that says you have been verified. We did the work. We called the insurance company. We verify it. And here's a little sticker that says they're verified. The insurance is good through such and such a day. Okay, so how do we get that information to you? Well, it's via a QR code that's on a photo ID badge. Now, I love the photo ID badge. I've been using them for years with commercial clients of mine. When you go into a commercial restroom to clean, you have a badge, you tap your arm up against the sticker on the wall and it shows what cleaning technician is cleaning that restroom at a particular time. I love it for that reason. All right, so here's the cool part. What happens is you get to a customer's house, the customer says, can I verify your records? And you say yes, and you have a picture ID that you can retract and let them scan the code. When they scan the code, it takes them to a website. That website is going to have your name, the name that's on your name badge, and it's gonna have a picture of your face. And this is also cool because if they scan the QR code and they are not at home when you arrive, they can see the person coming up to their ring doorbell and they're gonna see your face and they're gonna match it with the one that's on their computer screen. And they're gonna go, oh yeah, yeah, this is the person that's authorized to be inside my home. It's got all your training and certification, which is where Savvy Cleaner comes in, which is my company. So all the cleaning companies that are going through Savvy Cleaner training and certifications right now, we have authorized your information to go on that website. So they've removed the grades. So if you got like a bad grade or something, it's not gonna show. But if you ended up getting the certification and you took the class a couple of times, that's what will show up. And they have a certificate of insurance on file. They have been verified. This is also a great application if you want to add other things like are you vaccinated or do you have a green card or do you have a work permit to work at a particular age, for example. And the cool part is you can also include third party certifications as well. You pay a one time document fee for I believe it's like $10. That is not through Savvy Cleaner. Savvy Cleaner will cover your photo, your company logo to verify that you're with the right company that you said you're with and also your uh, certificate of insurance, as well as all of your training and certifications, okay? You can add other things like, I'm a member of Toastmasters, or I'm a member of the Chamber of Commerce, or I'm a member of the Better Business Bureau, or other things, other achievements, a high school or a college diploma that you have. When a customer says, can I verify your records? Yes, you let them scan your badge, and it takes them there, and they can see all of your achievements, and that you are qualified to be inside their home. I know, super excited, I absolutely love it. There's one more part that's really great. At the bottom of the page, there's a place to leave a rating and review for that individual technician. So if you are only a solo operator, you are one person, they can leave you ratings and reviews just from that QR code. They live forever. So those, those ratings and reviews, they're all search engine optimized. 
And there was a person that we plugged in the other day that had been on the site for less than a week with the Savvy Cleaner training and certification. And they were number one and number two search engine for their name on the front page of Google. And I sat there going, booyah, a couple of rules of protocol. You want to wear it on the outside of your clothing, whatever that is. If you're wearing a hoodie or a sweater, if it's cold weather, so that it is visible at all times. The next thing is if you wear a badge holder with a plastic covering like this and you add like a debit card or a credit card or cash or business cards behind the, the photo, you want to make sure it's behind your scannable card so that people can see you at a glance. The other thing is don't put stickers or deface the front of it. Use a magic marker or anything to cover over the photo or the QR code that makes it inoperable. We want to encourage it for this reason. This is kind of a little secret. After someone goes through all of your achievements and then they get to the part where they leave a rating and review, how do they feel about you now? This is a person that's trained, certified, has insurance. This is a person that showed up when they said they were going to show up. They did a great job cleaning my house. I want to leave you a great rating and review right now, right? So this is a process that is going to make it easy for everyone to validate your information lickety split. So as we up level the game of cleaning, I want you to be verified. Oh, 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 and I almost forgot the verify my records program is not just for savvy cleaner house cleaners. It's also available to painters and landscapers and window washers and deck builders and people that have other businesses that also want to take advantage of the verify my records program and also the photo ID badges. So I will leave links in the show notes to those, but we are insisting and encouraging everyone in the Savvy Cleaner Network program to participate with the photo ID badges. It's going to make it easier on your customers. It's going to make it easier on you. And it's going to give everybody the peace of mind knowing that the professionals that they've hired are actually professionals. Alrighty, until we meet again, leave the world a cleaner place than when you found it. Thank <laughs> you.